you guys so i just realized that this stuff might be a scam because Welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video today is a vlog video yes i'm actually going out now but i was like you know what? let me just make this intro real quick so that i will not forget so hi guys welcome back to my channel it's farid ali on your screen if you are new here do hit that subscribe button and to my ogs thank you all for always coming back always always coming back to this channel now this vlog is going to be like a job interview vlog i'm going for a job interview tomorrow i got a mail so i'm going for a job interview tomorrow and it's going to be like it's going to be like my official first job interview like formal one yeah i have one i've had one before but that was like informal so, so this one is going to be like very very formal so i'm going to bring you guys along okay so enjoy the next day hi guys my face is even bloated <laughs> i did not sleep like are you guys i set my alarm for 5 50. i didn't know it was pm and one mind was telling me that for uh, this alarm could be 5 50 pm but i was like eh, no worries you guys i woke up by 6 25 for this goddamn interview why do my what does my face look like this good so so ugly but anyways i'm already going sha I'll let you guys know how it goes, if it is going to be easy or I'll struggle getting the place. I want to quickly check to my bus stop. I'm already late though, Abby. It's already 7 o'clock. But I want to see if, like when I get it, if I can be leaving my house by 7. Let me see how it will be for this big church there. So that's the plan. But I doubt. These streets, you guys hold your phone very well because <laughs> you never can sell. Anybody can just drag it. I want to also calculate the transportation. Let me see how it's going to be favorable for me. <sighs> I'm nervous. I'm never see. I never study for the interview. I don't even know what I want to talk about in this interview. Me, I just did go. I'm going for the experience because it's my like official first interview ever. So. I just dropped from the first bus and it was 100 naira. So now I'm going to go and get the second one. Let me know how much. We have one pass now. It's currently after 7. Uh, the interview is by 8. So hopefully I'll make it in time. See, my sleep gets me. I want to sleep. Good. All these crannies I'm passing like this thing. You guys, I was chatting and I passed my bus stop. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going, so I have like 30 minutes spare time, Sha, because I reached here before 30 minutes. So that means I can wake up by 7 and still get here in time. So right now, I had to ask somebody to direct me, and she was like kind of confused. But I'm using Google Map to locate myself. Even if I'm late today, which I plan not to be late, I will um, take corrections when I get a job, if I get a job, by the grace of God. So. Yes, and she said I look sweet. She said I look sweet. She said I look sweet and I'm blushing because I heard you guys, I forgot to tell you guys, my mask matches my shoe. That's why I wear it because I'm wearing too much black and white and I'm like, you know what? Let me just add color. So yes, my mask matches my <laughs> say matches. That's extra hundred naira. So far I've spent um of a dilemma right now because i have two interviews actually but the one i'm staying here for is like it's bullshit so i think i'm just going to like pick an uber and go to the island for the other interview that is going to be better for me <laughs> say hi i'm a youtuber <laughs> you guys so i just realized that this stuff might be a scam because 
we all that came for the interview have different different firms same address different different names of the firms luckily for me i have two interviews today this marks obey yourself i have two interviews today so i'm just going to dump this one run to that one and see how far so let me not just miss anything i am in a taxi now uber i'm going to the second interview this first one they are scammers liars first off when i when i saw the interview invite i always ensure to make inquiries and browse online and check oh if this is legit so when i browsed online i didn't see any information i, I didn't see their company's um company's instagram handle company's website i didn't see anything but i was like okay I, I did not see any bad review however but i was like let me just go let me just try my luck it might be legit so on getting there we were all seated i couldn't vlog because not everybody wants to show your face on camera we were all seated there we were all watching you know waiting and looking at each other so i was like okay what um what is the name of this the place i was like okay what is the name of the company that sent you a mail and they're like they called different different companies some people were calling something diamond something another one was something i'm like eh my own is crown globe ventures why is it put on different i was not like okay maybe I'm at, I'm at the wrong place i went back to make inquiries and i was like where is this location they were like is this same place is this same place like eh, but why is it that we have different um different people having different company names you get so i went to ask the immediately my man was like okay let me just go and look for it whatever i'll take me to the island to go and do what i want to do so i now went to ask the um i went to ask the security man that you have you been working here he was like yes he has been working here for a very long time i said okay good um what do they do here that he doesn't know i'm like how won't you know what they do here if you are not among the scam this guy was ignoring me so much i was like nah this thing has to be gnl gnld according to how they call it i'll put the the phone description on the screen so guys i'm sure by now you all have seen the clip and everything so i was like you know let me just cut in quickly and explain to you guys what gnld is all about i don't really have extensive knowledge about gnld and the likes but what i know they do is that it is not like a scam scam they will kill you or steal your money i've never experienced it but based on the stories i've heard gnld like i think they are a company that sells supplements yes supplements like drugs and all those stuff so what they do is that they call you in with false pretense like let's say for example you go online looking for a job then you see so so job role or description so so job title that okay come to so so place for the job interview some of those jobs are gnld in the sense that they will call you when you come for that interview instead of you to be interviewed you'll be introduced to a product they'll tell you that okay they want to teach you how to make money and you don't have to work for anybody you know all those stuff how to make quick money you have to register under this you have to bring new people the more you the more people you bring the more money you get or the more your star goes up you know all those kind all those kind of things like you know like oriflame long green all those kind of people that sell all those drugs cream all those things that's what gnld is all about now the downside is that you are looking for a job you're a job seeker looking for a job you go online you see this job well put together and the salary is okay then you now apply and they send you a mail that okay come for an interview let's say you're living in Okorodu, you're living in Ibadan, you're living in Ogo state then you take a bus down to lagos especially ikeja you guys ikeja is their depot so let's say you take a bus from Okorodu or, or you're anywhere then you come to Lagos. Oh, you are you already kitted up, you know, looking all smart and shit. Then you go for this interview, only to realize that it is a scam, like it is false, it's GNLD. Like you are looking for a job, you're not looking for products to start selling for anybody. Like, how would you feel? I'm even lucky that my house is not far from a Keja, but guy, babes, people are coming from Lekki, people are coming from Ikorodu, people are coming from far, far places, only to realize realize that it is GNLD let's get back to the video they'll just scam people tell them to come to their office they have a job for them blah 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 when you now come it is not a job you are coming to see you are coming to see them trying to market their products for you they will even ask you to pay their brainwash you and all those stuff you guys i had to run i ran away because right now 
I can't continue wasting my time there, so I'm just going to head to the island and try my other lock and see how it goes. So guys, having, having said that, I want to advise you guys, I want to tell you guys some tips that you should take. If you're living in Lagos, just know that most of Ikeja job interviews are false and they are GNLD. So you have to be wary and you have to be careful. I myself I feel like I was very foolish, I don't know, because... I'm a smart person, she'll get. I'm a very smart person, like, I'm a very smart, careful, conscious person, name it. I'm not trying to, like, blow my trumpet or be cocky, but that's the truth. But you see this particular job, I don't know. When I saw the interview invite, I was like, okay. Because I had two, one on the island, one on the mainland. I was like, okay, fine, I live center, I live in the center of Lagos. So I was like, you know, let me just go for the mainland one because it is closer an island like i was just weighing my option because okay if i get the job how will i be going to island every day even though it's possible but i was like how will i shuffle mainland is better for me so i just like i was like i was like okay let me leave island go to mainland right so you guys before i went for this job i actually searched online my brother was like check this job online do they have a company name do they have a website rather do they have a Instagram page facebook all those things just to just do some background checks so i did check online i didn't see any website i didn't see any instagram handle i didn't see any um facebook but i went on naira land you guys naira land is underrated that place is your friend because honestly you know there, there are people that that talk see i'm not going to go deep down on naira land, but if you need any info just go to Naira you get it. So I went on Naira Land, but I didn't see any negative comments about this particular um, company. I didn't even see any comp. I didn't even see the company name there. I was like, okay, since there are no negative comments on this company, let me just go and try. It might be a new company, you know how foolish. So I went there and I realized it was GNLD. You guys will watch the video, right? Beware of job interviews online. Beware always do background checks always vet check for website check for instagram check for youtube check for whatsapp check for everything ask people go on naira land check 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 see you can what, what you can do is you can go on naira land look for all those um threads that shows job application job vacancy and, stuff, and then post your message and tell them that okay who has head of this particular company or who has head who has head and they will tell you and if you're in lagos be wary of ikeja ikeja is their depot like ikeja is where they where they, where they hold um all these fake fake job interviews and i think i will try and put the picture of my interview invite so you guys can see see the format and you guys can understand that it's fake and you guys can also see the address in case you get the job interview for this particular address you guys will know and again what else um be very careful that's the most important thing be very careful if the if the building they ask you to come to the address they give you is like fishy and they don't have their like brand name or their company name on the on the building like they don't have a poster or a signboard don't enter trust me do not enter I would have stayed back in that interview and filmed everything but i had two job interviews i told you guys so i was like you know what since on this gnld let me not waste my time here let me go to the island so i did go to the island now another thing is that this generally they think they are smart what they do is that when you as a as a candidate or an applicant you are like waiting for your interview you are, you are outside sitting they will come and act like they are also a candidate to, to fool you. So when I went, when I went for that job interview, right, I was seated with other people. I couldn't vlog because I wasn't comfortable too. So one woman came and she was like talking. She sat down. She was like trying to have a conversation with us. And she was like, "Hi, that she has been here. This is her second time coming here. That she used to this place." She was like trying to make us feel comfortable. So I was like, "Okay, what do they do here?" Because I was like. Oh. This thing doesn't look legit anymore. It's like, oh man, what did what do you guys do here? What do they do here? She's like, don't worry, relax. That they recruit people for firms. I was like, oh, like, okay, that's why we all have different different names on our interview invite. She was like, yes, I don't worry, I should calm down. They are recruiters. They they recruit people for other firms. They are people like that, yes. But I was like, okay, what are their names? Like the recruiting firm, waiting be their name. 
she's like yeah don't worry that she doesn't really know the answer like she was just trying to like dodge the question i was like mm -hmm. the one guy they said was not like hmm, that she's sounding like one of them i was like seems so to me i just called Uber and i left and i left they are not killers though they are not killers but they are scammers and i heard that they can even brainwash you to like patronize them buy their products you know invest with them all those stuff so you need to be wary okay check the job interviews you get check the interview invites you get and be wary so yeah guys you guys can continue watching the video i just had to cut in real quick to give you guys gist, the gist 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 so i know i'm looking all nerdy like i'm looking all nerdy honestly but yes i love it i made my hair myself bye guys they posted all these jobs online and i was like okay let me go and try okay. this was now at home doing nothing yeah, yeah, yeah. so i came here very early i came Long nights, alone, sleeping by myself with no one to hold and I think Don't you worry my friend, you've got time But right now I think I need someone who takes me to dinner and wine